it hooks from friends look so i've been on for a while it's just that i've been organizing some kits up and i just got stuck involved i just couldn't stop and i just got carried on and carried on and carried on so i do apologize right in 2018 a long time ago i saw my repair kit and i liked it but the truth is everything's changed i've updated it recently this is it and the reason i'm showing you because i want to transfer it into a bigger pouch as you can see it's quite small i do like the size of this one so why don't you tell me what you think if you would add it into a bigger pouch or you'll just keep it in a nice small pouch like that yeah um i have not got no buckles or clips in my Repair kit, sorry, I had a point what he's saying. Because my club buckles this small time, I've changed them to Cobra buckles. Buck, Cobra buckles. It's, they're metal, so in theory they shouldn't break. In theory, but we don't know. I've not, I've tested them, don't get me wrong. But, right, this is it. I'm going to go through the back first. In here. Is where I keep 99% of my needles. So, yeah. Crazy thing. I don't know if anybody else carries one, but I have a big lighter in the back of one of those sleeves. I have one of these fishing um, clippers, but I find these were better than carrying scissors because they're nice and flat and they are sharper. So, that all was in the back of that piece there. Right, let's go into the main body now. So, I have some spare buttons for my jacket. This is no in no order, by the way. I have some shoe goo. That's good stuff. Some repair duct tape, I think it was called. Not 100% sure, don't quote me on that. And inside, a small piece of Glow, um, glow stick, glue gun, glue, glue. I have some zips, what you can repair the zips with, where you can replace the zip if they break. I do have the sizes I need, I don't carry the sizes I don't need as well. You've seen this before, this is the Echo Tap Rip Spool. It's still the same one, I've still not touched it, I've still not used it, so yeah. Two lots of um super glue. So that's all what's in that front pouch there. We're going into the back now, and this one here is just 99% of my cons. So I do have some Kevlar. Cordage. I can't remember what strain that is, so I'm not even going to say because it's just hard. I remember. And two lots of reinforced cordage. Um, cordage. Right. This bread is the stuff I use on my rucksack when I'm modifying the rucksack. This stuff is so strong that I've tried to break it and I nearly cut my fingers in. I've literally cut right into my fingers, so I know it's strong and it's holding up quite well on all the other rucksacks. So, yeah, I have two of them. I have some of this tape, what Mad Dog recommended. This goes on your on your boots if your boots split on the soles. I've got one of them. I do have one of these in my boot cleaning kit, care kit. So, I have spare. I have this one here on nail in here. So, then I've got it all over the place. I do have some on my walking stick as well, if I remember rightly. So, yeah. Last thing. There's nothing to do with repair. I just put them in every little piece of kit that I've got them. That is some storm, US, a UCO stormproof matches. You don't really need these in your, in your repair kit, but I have them in mine. So, yeah. And all of that, I'm thinking of adding it. I apologise about that, guys. It's just cut off for me, so I do apologise. So, as I was saying, I have got this pouch here. And this is the original pouch I put all of that stuff in. It was this one here. And I am thinking about adding it to this one. 
so it's a little bit bigger so I can add a little bit more stuff if that makes any sense because this one here was quite tight to have all that lot in so you tell me what would you do would you go for pouch this one a or would you carry on with pouch b so yeah well i'm leaving it here guys because i don't know how long it is now because of what's happened thank you very much for watching please like please share please subscribe and please join us here at film film with friends i know i've said subscribe but hey ho and um go on facebook instagram and you can hear me email me at lowercase plumofence90 at gmail.com. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.